But for uh, the last minute or so, I'd love to hear from you uh, whether you've seen any success stories. Are there any countries that seem to be really ahead of the curve in terms of trying to provide these mental health supports? Yeah, you know, it's it's interesting. You know, usually when we talk about emergencies, we talk about emergencies as an opportunity for making a change, for bringing awareness to mental health and really investing in uh, support and, and building care systems for young children and families. Um, and I touched a little bit on stigma uh, and discrimination, and maybe it, it's a good opportunity to maybe talk a little bit about um, an experience that we had in Kazakhstan. Uh, Kazakhstan, about a decade ago, was had one of the highest adolescent suicide mortality rates in the world. And suicide was the leading cause of death among adolescents ages 15 to 19. Um, and since 2012, UNICEF has collaborated with the government of Kazakhstan to develop and implement adolescent mental health and suicide prevention program. And this program um, is a school-based response that aims to strengthen um, the national education and health system's ability to respond to adolescents' mental health and psychosocial needs. Um, and it does this by improving early identification and referral of those at risk. Fast forward to 2018, we've scaled up the implementation to over 1,500 schools across five regions. And an evaluation very recently found that adolescents who are identified at risk experience a significant decrease in suicidal ideation, depression, and anxiety, and stress after receiving, after receiving treatment. And so this is a really successful example of where you know, we're able to um, mobilize resources Resources, understand the problems that are experienced at the country level and respond and scale up an effective and promising approach to um, address mental health issues, at decrease risk and improve access to services um, and roll that out at the national level. And importantly, really focus in on the data piece. It is because of the data available in Kazakhstan that we were able to identify a problem. And it is through data that we're able to understand better uh, that what we are doing works. And we're seeing a decrease in, 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 in mental health issues, um, as well as uh, building and contributing to the evidence that could be applied in other countries and other settings.